This is Madman Den, Operation Dark Horizon, January 1941, the UK and France. So, uh, Japan has finally taken the Dutch East Indies along with Germany, which uh, we're surprisingly okay with, apart from the fact that they get a bunch of money, because we have gotten a couple subs out of the deal, and uh, we got to collect some income for a couple, well, maybe exactly one turn. Uh, the Soviets have gone in and taken Finland and also given us uh, another couple extra units. Uh, the Germans should have completed their Atlantic Wall, I believe. I'm not too sure where that fort or coastal gun ended up. And the UK was bombed reasonably well. Um, at least we took out the strategic bomber, which is one less unit we have to worry about. And we didn't actually get raided for a whole too much, so it was a pretty okay for the pretty okay for as far as the UK is considered. Um, uh, one sort of one cleanup that we have to do is Southern Norway. Um, the Sky Marshal wasn't didn't end up adding uh, the mountain penalty for his airborne, so this will go to a third round. So he'll be attacking at one, and the now British guy will be defending at four. So one on the left and four on the right. So hopefully we can kill the perfidious Russians. That's a no, and that's a no. The 10 for the attack and a nine. I feel like this might be the how I spend most of my, my turn <laughs> is resolving this. No and no. Probably should switch these die, and that's a hit for the defender. So, uh, uh, no way stands. So we can get rid of the Soviet occupation and the Soviet airborne, and we, uh, we, we, the forces of freedom, Hold Norway for the time being. Just pop a oversized rumble there. Okay, so I think we're back on track more or less, uh, and I think we can start rolling some tech. We only have two tech rolls, and we really do have to catch up. So we're rolling for radar and improved construction. Improved construction is the green. Um, we'll see. Fingers crossed. Uh, we got one radar. We're one closer to uh, finally getting a tech. Yeah, that's a one. Too bad. Okay, our buys. We should have twenty-four dollars as the Brits. We're gonna fix the eight damage. We're going to build an infantry, uh, infantry upgrade, and three militia, and that should be. Uh, oh, and also we are starting a fortification in Egypt. So I'll just copy that. It's basically the uh, this border, the western border. So that would be 5, 8, 13, uh, 16, and 8 more. That is 24. FVC is going to get a Gurkha, an A gun, a militia, and a militia upgrade. Um, so we're going to zero those out. And the French are going to spend their Eight bucks on two foreign legions, plus the one they get for free. Okie dokie. Uh, combat moves. So I don't think we're really having any combat moves of note here. Uh, yeah, no combat moves of, out here. So I think we are just going to jump to the other side of the board. Nothing over here. Anything over here? We are going to continue to raid because that's fun. And you know what? Let's um, maybe get lucky and try to go for a underdefended. Well, he hits better than me, but I could get lucky. One, two, three. He is going to try and sink a destroyer. And I 
I have a free medium bomber, so let's just let's bomb a railway here. Uh, maybe in five turns from now we'll be able to cut them off from supplies. Do we have a damaged rail? Yes, we do. Uh, as far as I'm aware, the air base is not complete, so we don't have to worry about any scrambling. So this medium bomber will do the trick. One, two, three, four, five, six. He'll land back in southern England. Um, and so let's just get to our rolling. I think so. Sadly, all we have is... Oh, right. Um, these... These ships are going to move one, two. The fourth fleet's going to combat move in here and just escort them together. Uh, and did we want to bring in this destroyer as well? I think we should leave that guy on escort duty. Uh, on second thought, well, he'll come as well, so. He will also be part of that maneuver. Uh, so I think we can get to the rolling bits. Okay, um, do we want to do anything with this guy? No. Okay, so we are going at a... Oh, this guy. This coastal submarine can either move one and die next turn, move one and raid this turn and maybe die. We will... Ah, why not? We'll go for the raid. Uh, and second thought, he'll just... Yeah, he'll go for the raid. It's a 50-50 it's a shot, but <laughs> I'm, no, he's just going to non-combat somewhere. We don't really care. Okay, so let's start over here. Uh, he'll be defending at a 4, and myself, I'm attacking at a 3. So we'll just have to hope for the best. So on the left is the attacker, and the right is the defender. <laughs> well, we kill each other in a blaze of glory. Uh, well, I don't call it Blaze, but another two ships to Iron Broad and Sound, as they call it. Uh, all right. Well, I guess that could have gone worse. Uh, we are going to do some raiding up here. So I think, yeah, I said we just stay in that zone. There's not really much reason we have to move. Yeah, not reason, no reason at all. In fact, Oh yeah, he does have long range, so it yep. Yeah. Okay, right. Sorry, the red is the attacker, the black is the defender. Uh, we take a dollar off the off the Japanese. Uh, if I can find a damage rumble. And that's it. Okay. Um I think we can then, if I haven't missed anything, jump to non-combat. So this medium bomber is going to fly back to southern England. This seaplane is going to fly to southern England. Uh, we're going to get this destroyer. He can go one, two, three out of here. This torpedo boat destroyer can go one, two, and Any point to go? No, he can actually just go one, two into port in northern England. There we go. Uh, oh, I forgot to say that my battleship is, still, is staying still so he can repair. Uh, we're good with leaving the rest of this stuff here. In fact, we will put a British transport into port in A21. The... 
Yeah, he's going to H21. He'll be fine. Let's not think too much about it. Um, what next were we going to do? Uh, that's good. We've moved everything down here that we want to move. Uh, nothing of note down here. We are going to reorganize Calcutta a bit. Um, I think we're going to rail one infantry to Maharashtra. Let's walk this Gurkha down. Let's move an artillery and AA gun. Yes. Oh, I forgot about this again. Let's let's start over. So from Calcutta to Maharashtra, we are gonna rail an infantry. From Delhi to Maharashtra, we're gonna move a Gurkha. From Benares to Bengal, we're moving an artillery. From uh, Benares or to Calcutta, we're gonna move this motorized infantry. And if I didn't mention it, Calcutta to Benares, a uh, triple A gun. Uh, and let's go ahead and put two Gurkhas into Bengal. I think that should be enough to dissuade any sort of funniness, but famous last words. Um, so I had three Gurkhas left in Calcutta. I'm not moving anything down here. Uh, this coastal submarine, uh, he'll just, you know what? He'll move from P-59 to P-61. Uh, he's still in danger, but there is nowhere we can really run to. Uh, and I think that is our moves. Oh yeah, he'll move. To, sorry, he'll move from P59 to I, uh, I think that's 13. And that will be that for the British, I believe. Oh, we're going to bring this tactical bomber up one, two, three, uh, four. And he'll land on the carrier. And with that, we are done, I believe. Okay. Um, with additional income, I believe we are collecting 29 and 3, if I recall correctly. Um, yeah, 29 and 3. So, uh, we're up to 32 as the Brits. No, I think we are up to 33 because we... Start at 25. We have one for Belgium, three for the Dutch right now, and one for Norway. So 33. Uh, FEC is collecting 12. And I guess we'll do France in a second. So uh, we put down our fort. We're going to zero off this damage. Uh, we still can't use that factory, so we are going to put uh, infantry in Cape Town, a militia and militia upgrade in to Gibraltar, and I think we're just going to throw down a militia in southern England. Oh, and Sorry, I forgot a non-combat. We are going to move a AA gun into southern England. I think that's... I think that... <sighs> that's fine. Uh, no, it's not. <laughs> Uh, if you will allow me to take one more non-combat, we're going to move one uh, one infantry from London to Southern England. So uh, in summary, one infantry and one AA gun from London to Southern England. 
uh, we're meeting these two guys here. Uh, we move that guy there. So I think we are done. Okay, on to France. France is going to make uh, another couple of combat moves. We are going to walk into Smash Morocco and take that for good French. I guess I never forgot to zero those out. Uh, these guys are not doing any non-combats. If you'll allow me, we might as well just put a torpedo destroyer out here for reasons. Um, next, we are going to leave our fleet here. We are, you know, this sort of worked out. So let's not, let's try it again. This French sub will move one, two and take on this Japanese destroyer. So again, um, one at three attacking and one at four defending. Oh, and there we go. That's a hit for us and a miss for the defender. All right. Ooh, that was kind of nice for us. Okay, uh, France is pretty much done. Well, oh, sorry, done with the combats. They have a non combat, they're going to take this medium bomber and he's going to fly down to Jill Balter. So that's going to be one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. We are going to rail a foreign legion down to Egypt from Syria. We're going to move two foreign legions from Syria down to Transjordan. And that is it, I believe. Uh, we do have a recruitment with someone, either France or Great Britain. I'm confused who get, actually gets it. But we'll do that there. Nope. And we can collect some income and place some units. So we're going to place two Foreign Legion in French Morocco and one Foreign Legion in Syria. Uh, the French will collect some number of dollars. Uh, they're down to four, and I think they collect one more for five. And with that, oh, I don't think I... I don't think I placed these two militias and my FEC units for that matter. Uh, so we did a militia militia upgrade. Uh, I think I may have placed one militia here, but I'll have to review this. But let's just say we place one more militia in southern England and one more militia in. Let's just do two more militia in southern England. I think there might only be three here, but let's let's me think. Let me think about this. So I had two here, three there. Yeah, I'll just have to review this after the fact. Um, but uh, FEC should be easy enough. Oops. So we have. One AA gun going in Calcutta. We're going to put one militia into Maharashtra. We're going to put one infantry that one infantry from a militia into Calcutta, and one Gurkha into Bengal. And I think that is it for us. This has been Mad Man Dan passing you off to Panzer J. I hope everyone has a good night and bye.